Hey guys, I'm back for part two of my unboxing of my LV recent products. So the first part of the unboxing, I basically unboxed the stuff that's on my wrist right now. I recently bought this bangle that I've decided to pair it with um, my other bracelets, the love bracelet and tennis bracelet on the left hand side of my arm. And the other product I got on my first part of unboxing is this Year of the Rabbit um, LV monogram leather kind of uh, bracelet. So today we will be unboxing a product in here as well as, uh, and these are um, this year's LV holiday packaging in red. So let's go. I actually cut this the longest when they didn't even have the holiday packaging yet. I believe I actually got this on during on Halloween. So October 30th. When I saw I come out with the bando. So if you followed me previously, I did a vlog in LV showing this bando. That is for the CNY Chinese New Year. Let me get a close-up so everyone can see. This is actually really beautiful and I'm really happy with this purchase. I like so look at this ribbon in the sun, it's so cute. And the Elma BB. I'm a fan of this one in particular. The rabbit with the loop and a cap. So cute. The other side is pure. So this is one of my first purchases, and it matches the bracelet perfectly. And then we have this item. Let's see this one. Got it during um, it's been a month since <laughs> I purchased this at the shop and I still haven't unboxed like the previous packaging they have the orange ribbon this year with the Lego cards I only got the blue ones black side trunk that was on the 2023 cruise collection runway. I wanted to get a close look at this because it looks very structured but on the top it's actually very like soft. strap where you can use it as cross body. I believe the short straps are here as well. It's super soft inside guys. Uh, micro fiber material. It smells really nice. And um, silver hardware. So I don't have anything from LV in this black Skin. It's super nice. In my opinion. So let me get some close ups and I'll show you the detail. I will remove the stickers off camera. And then I'm likely put, to put this bandeau, rabbit bandeau, 
for the shoulder strap that I'll be using. I think I'll be using this bag more for the shoulders with the shoulder strap than the uh, body, cross body. It depends because it's very flexible with the detachable strap. And let's see the um, it has feet. The long strap where you can combine it and then this is actually the shoulder strap so let me try to put the shoulder strap on and get a feel of how long it is So this model actually came out with obviously majority of the um, unboxings I've been seeing for the side trunk is the monogram canvas version in the uh, treated fish I did a lot of it, but leather but for myself I decided on this black one because um, I living in Hong Kong where it's been raining even if it's the treated fish 100% it will get dirty or it would spot so I think the black leather and this hardware with the black um, straps rather than the shara would be more suitable for someone like me in uh, living in Hong Kong where it would just suddenly rain and um, yeah so the opening I, some people said that you know it's quite hard but I think for me and having a lot of micro bags this bag could actually fit quite a bit um, compared to the smaller bags and I do love the fact that it's completely structured but yet it's actually super soft and the design is pretty cool I mean like some people said that this might be annoying but I, I you know like Hermes you don't really need to uh, close this if you don't want you can make it more casual and it's just an easy bag so yeah wanted to do a close-up Until next time, guys. Thanks for watching.